it's Angie from Canterbury Trails Farm. Today I'm going to show you how to make quick and easy seed packets or seed envelopes for your own seeds. This is a really easy project and this is a great project for kids. All you need is some paper and a glue stick, some scissors. Before I get into making it, you can order stamps. Off, I ordered mine off Zazzle. I usually when I send out seeds, if someone asks for some or I know people that want some, um, I use like a white, a white um, adhesive label and I just put my stamp on there for our Canterbury Trails Farm and um, I got my logo on the seed packets and I just put it on the front of the seed packets. Um, I, I'm not, I don't really remember how much the Zazzle thing cost. Um, I don't think it was much and I think they had like a coupon for first time user and I think it probably came out to be like six dollars or something like that. It's really cool to have to use um, for all kinds of projects. So let's look at the little template. I'm going to use this. I, I found that what's really great is origami paper because you can get them. They're so, you can get big tablets of them like at Michael's um, and they're just really pretty. Like this one's reversible. So the inside of the envelope is actually, it looks really fancy. I mean, it's nice. So let's go ahead and do one. So I already, I have this little template that I've been using for like ever. I keep saying what I want to do is like get it in wood or plastic or something and then I can, I'd have it. It's like permanent. I'm just going to do it on the side that will be the inside of my seed packet. Just trace around it. Really easy. So this is a great project for kids. See if you have a lot of, if you save a lot of seeds. It gives them something to do and feel useful. And you just I'm going a little fast here. I'd probably be a little bit neater if I was doing this. So there's what the uh, when you cut it out, and then just gonna make your folds. This way, just so I know how to fold it there. Like I said, it's all different styles. So when you get it um, cut and folded, give that a really good crease there. I'm just gonna take my glue stick. line up just trim it off and there you go now it's like I said this this reversible side makes it look like one of those like fancy envelopes that have a liner so just there you go took me like two seconds I have a little pile of them I've been working on and uh, like I said I love these origami papers because there's just so many you know the cheerful cheerful little prints and um, you can get this one has a, this one's glossy and these aren't so this one even looks like you know something you'd buy in the store so it's really cool and like I said I could just get a little adhesive label and um, or I'm just gonna cut this out of paper just get your if you have a logo for your homestead or your business or whatever you want or your kids name. This wasn't even adhesive. This was just a piece of paper. I'm going to stick it right on the front. Now I have a seed packet. So it's really, they're really easy and it's really fun. But I think the glue stick, the craft glue stick works really good. Elmer's or whatever. It's fun. It's a really quick project. Like I said, if you don't like this style of template that I was using, if you like maybe a pointy, pointy um, flap or something, uh, just go, just, just look for a free downloadable um, seed packet templates or free printable downloadable um, seed packets and you'll find all kinds of um, free templates and actual seed envelopes that you can just print off and it's a fun little project and I just keep a whole bunch of them made in a little baggie and then I have them ready to go um, 
and you can put like I said you can put your label on there or you can just have I mean it's really pretty I've found that like if you have you know like if you have like I don't know four or five different kinds of seeds you can put all the little packets together and tie them with a little ribbon for like a little gift it's really cute and it's something that you have if you have surplus seeds um, it's a way to use those up and it's a nice gift and um, it's a really quick project but it's so much fun and like I said it's a great project for kids and the whole family to get in on so thank you for joining me today at Canterbury Trails Farm. Bye!